Hello friends. Today we are going to see how to load personal payment method using HDLs. So first we will see sample data template for uh, personal payment method. So these are the mandatory or required fields which we have taken from sample template. So you can find the sample template link in the description of video. So let's prepare the data template for personal payment method. So first metadata is merge, then object name which is personal payment method, then enter the source key. As we all know that source system owner is xx test, then enter the source system id. Source system id must be the unique for this object. Then enter the legislative data group name and enter the assignment number. Assignment number of employee for which you want to add the personal payment method. Then enter the personal payment method code. You can enter the personal payment method code as per your convenience. Then enter the effective start date for this payment method. Then enter the payment amount type. Payment amount type is P. Then enter the amount. We are not entering any amount so keep it is blank then enter the percentage how much percentage you want to add for this 10 percent 20 50 currently i am adding 100 percent payment from this payment method you can enter as per your convenient then enter the pro processing order which is first then en enter the payment method code which is direct deposit so direct deposit will be in bank so bank name will be as American bank we have loaded the bank details in our earlier video so I have copied that bank name from earlier HDL file and same for bank branch name uh, number will use the bank branch number from bank branch dot that file which we have seen in earlier videos then bank country code which is US then bank account number here you can add last four digit if you are using the masking in your setup so just give last four digits so that it will ma it will show as masking after loading the bank account number then add bank account type which is checking so if you are using the masking functionality for bank account number then Whenever you are uh, preparing the HDLs, bank account number should be only last four digit if you are using masking functionality. If you are, if you give all digits of bank account number, then it will throw you an error. So just give the last four digit if you are using masking functionality for bank account number. Then we'll save this template and make the zip file or personal payment method dot that file make it zip now we'll open the application and we'll move navigate to the data exchange from my client group then import and load data click on the import file choose your file zip file submit that import file
once you have submitted the file click on the refresh so you will find personal payment method dot zip file is available in the status so currently it is in import process so we'll refresh it to get the status of the file if it's imported or not now you can see how file has been successfully imported into the system now loading is in process here you can see loading is also successful so our whatever the data we pass through the hdls has been loaded successfully into the system you can see load success percentage is 100% so it means our data has been successfully loaded into the system so now we will check whether that per, uh, employee have attached that these personal payment details or not so we'll navigate to the person management so go to the home page in my client group person management search for the respective person which we you have loaded the uh, personal payment methods click on the search open the employment of the that person once the employment page is open then click on the task pan in payroll you can find personal payment method here you can find one personal payment method has been successfully populated over here whatever we have passed through the hdls here we can see so you you can see the name even all the details like american bank branch bank account number here you can see the bank account number has, which is masked one so last four digit and the before that masking that's the reason we are passing only last four digit using the hdls likewise you can load the personal payment methods for the employees